Also, now these days, you know, after... Yeah, uh, um, you know what the cost per semester is for me at a community college, which would get pretty much the same thing? I think yeah, it's something like... I a, don't want to know. Yeah, it, it's, it's fucking scary cheap. Yeah, fuck you. Yeah, I know. Y you can punch me in the nuts when we meet, if you meet up at XP Fest. If I fucking get the goddamn <laughs> money, I gotta get a new job first. How many people do you have lined up to nut punch Twist? Um... It's at least five, right? I'm not exactly five, keeping right? a running list. It's just, uh, if I see you and I remember I told you I was going to nut punch you, I'll probably then. So hopefully we have to rely on your poor memory. I don't know. I might actually remember quite a few people to punch in the dick. Somebody's getting punched in the dick for fucking SJW cat. Well, yeah. that goes without saying. Okay, I missed SJW cat. What the hell happened? Go to Anthony's channel. I'll link it here in a second. Did Lorcat go SJW for a few minutes? Yes. A few yes. minutes. And it was freaking annoying. Oh god. Didn't Lorcat say he used to be a massive SWJ? You mean SJW? Dude, a yeah. lot of us key old school internet people did, man. Like fucking, uh, I used to be a keyboard warrior back in the day. Well, if I remember right, You know right, what I used uh, to be back in the day? I used to be much more right wing. Up. Well, I used to be I much remember, more liberal. Well, if I remember right, um, I think Lorcat said that it was uh, back during when he was in high school that he was really young, all SJW. Yeah. It was just when he got out of high school is when things started changing. Man, you just you have to go through that phase where you're young and stupid. And then life hits you like a pipe wrench to the face. Yeah. I think for me it was when my mom died and I realized... None of this shit fucking matters. Yep. Someone's gonna die at the end of the day. Nothing you can do. It's sad. But it's life. And we must march yep. on. Yep. We, shall, we must also do all the clicking in the world. Must click more. Must click faster. Must click faster! Click, 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 click! More clicks. Must switch on turbo! No, not turbo. What if you run into the bubble fish? There's what, bubble fish? There is bubble fish, and he is hard oh, to God. kill, and he fucking hits you in one hit. I don't know if I'm gonna if I'm gonna die to that or not because I'm level twenty, and I've got all kinds of fucking awesome armor, and I'm well, gonna yeah. death amulet now. Level twenty, and you're How does still the death concerned. amulet work again? Uh, you trade it for life when you die. Okay, cool. Because I've got it equipped. And he brings you back at the same level, right? With all your equipment? I don't remember. I've never gotten a death amulet. Fuck. Well, I've got like a boatload of fucking potions. I've got like 245. Um, if you take a look at my stream, um, what I am doing is whenever, whenever I'm running low on health, I just put the mouse anywhere else and just let it set for a couple seconds and let the balls spam my health back, back up to, back up the top. Cool. It's also a good way to make money. I, I'm doing it the hard after way, forty son. seconds, I can't fucking take it. Lorcat sounding like uh, SJW just—it gets to me. Oh, it gets even oh. worse. Oh, you bitch! I the first that thirty the seconds aren't video. even the good ones. Yeah. Dude, they watch those videos. Tough enough. <laughs> yeah, I know. I just need a minute. I oh. watch what sober. I know. I do too. But last night I did have a glass of wine with a meal. I just get the popcorn. Yeah, I'm actually gonna grab another wine glass because I still got three more glasses in this bottle. Anyone else want wine? Uh, I have work tomorrow. Yeah, yeah I, I'm home from work. I don't need booze right now. <laughs> I'm gonna need. You're a in California. There's no way I'm getting wine. I if it were Monday, I would join. Wait, you. Whoa, 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 California, and you can't get wine? Bullshit. You're in California. I can't get wine. I, I oh, wouldn't. Okay. I wouldn't mind the wine. I just need a big wheel of cheese to go with it. Oh yeah. God damn it! Frick, there's no school tomorrow because of President's Day. I can't walk down to the fucking store. Yeah, that's right. I probably shouldn't anyway. Cause Don't worry, Twisted. I'm considering sending some wine ahead of me to XP Fest. You can't do it. What? Well, not officially. You can't send wine through the through the mail. Seriously? Seriously, you can't send alcohol because it's got laws and whatnot. Because of certain state laws. 
the transportation of alcohol. Damn it. Sorry, dude. As for not being able to get through, get to the store, just uh, hop on my jet, on my back. I'll trudge toward the store for you. <laughs> well, I was gonna send like do... a, I was gonna send like a half case ahead of me so that people at XP Fest could enjoy wine with me. Yeah, sorry, dude. What you could do is uh, call the airline you're gonna be flying in on and ask what their policy is on that. I mean, I probably might be able to get a couple of bottles of my luggage, but that's about it. Well, well, I wouldn't. I wouldn't plan on putting it in your luggage. Otherwise, you're gonna have wine-smelling luggage by the time you get there. Oh, but, I, I mean, yeah. There are ways to make it safe to transport. I know that. Yeah, but I would call the airline first and see. Yeah. Why would your luggage smell like wine? Isn't it? Because in the box? they it could throw break. it around. Yeah, oh. but if if I okay, twist it. If I wrap each bottle in bubble wrap, and then put that in just a, a series of extra layers of bubble wrap, it should be okay. Yeah, that's gonna send off, uh, set off the fucking sensors, dude. They do yeah, run true. that shit through check. I know. What about just Sometimes going through a website and having it uh, delivered to you at the hotel when you get there? Timing's a bitch. Mm. Unless they don't just... actually mail alcohol usually. Uh, uh, unless... Actually, you can mail order wine from various wineries in my area. Oh, okay. Um, I usually get uh, wines and gift baskets from uh, Wine Country Gift Baskets. Okay. It's actually rather nice. So, yeah, there's a couple know, maybe... places that you can uh, actually ask for a specific delivery date. And you know... usually they're on. Oh, sorry. Sorry. You, you know, they probably do have California wine at in uh, uh, Connecticut. Yeah, that's true. There's only four items here on the prohibited domestic items list at U, uh, U, USPS. Airbags, ammunition, explosive, and gasoline. I don't see anything about alcohol. Uh, I was at the post office. Prohibited international items do include alcohol. Does not say anything about domestic. I was at the post office with uh, in line waiting on something and this uh, guy tried to send whiskey in the mail and the guy told him he couldn't because of uh, state laws and whatnot for transportation. <laughs> Transporting yeah. alcohol across state lines. You yeah, can't do it for the post it office. Could, it could also vary from state to state as well. Yeah. It yeah. does. That's why you can't send it. Yeah. See, that's the problem. It's because it varies uh, via, uh, per each state. You can't send it. So I've got to find somebody in a state that, w that, uh, the state that will allow it. Because I know California allows it because they allow that shit to be shipped all the time. And, that ha and, that oh, yeah. and it has to be a state nearby that someone can drive. Hmm. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Is Kazi yeah. driving up? Yeah, I'd send it to LK, but I don't know if uh, how much he's got to transport uh, as is. Wait a minute, wait a minute. No, Kazi's, uh, Kazi's flying out. I was about to say, I do remember him saying they booked the, the, the room. I, I wasn't sure how he was getting there. Okay, I don't know how he's getting there either. Fuck, man, I love being able to go through an uh, half of the freaking uh, dungeon here and not have to use a single potion because I'm, I'm, I'm taking hits, but it's not doing much. I just now managed to kill Fraley at level 4. Nice. Dude, I'm up to level 21. I've got 20 attack and 34 defense. With the turbo on, I had to do a whole lot of jerking back and forth motions with the mouse, trying to trying to get a couple of hits out while at the same time going back so I can trigger more of the pachinko balls to, to re recover health. You gotta be careful with that turbo button, man. Okay, I just found a loophole using UPS. Okay. If I buy it direct from a winery, because I'm industry, I get an industry discount so the prices aren't that bad, I could theoretically, using my contact, say, hey, do you guys have a contract with UPS for shipping wine? And if you do, can you send this bottle to this location for me? That could work. Yeah, and then I, whoever that is, they'll just get like three or four packages in the mail, and then boom. They just bring it down with them. Yeah, I would go ahead and just send that to Lord Pat. Might have to ask if it's okay with him. Yeah, ask if it's okay with him first. Because uh, alcohol laws and shit in uh, fucking Connecticut. Yeah. Don't forget, yeah. though, that the hotel has a no alcohol policy. Yeah, that's for up in your room. 
Oh, well, okay. The hotel thought, room uh, counts as a private residence, yeah. temporary residence. So it can be consumed there. Also, I was planning on if anyone wants to get together for a meal that Sunday, that last Sunday night, bring a bottle or two with us to a restaurant so we can avoid the ungodly prices that most restaurants charge for wine. Is it red wine or white wine? I'm going to ship both. Okay. I'm taking only requests now. Actually, only wine I've ever actually had is the Boone's Farm wine, and it kind of tasted bad. But <laughs> I like the sangria soda, and from what I hear, the sangria is actually mostly wine anyway. So mm -hmm. it's pro if it's like a red wine, I might like it. Twisted, how much was that Boone wine you were talking about per bottle? Like five bucks. Five bucks. Yeah, you, you had some pretty bottom-of-the-barrel stuff. Twist, yeah, I know I nothing about wine, but I know that Boone's Farm is not real wine. Yeah. No. It's got like four percent alcohol in it. It's like a that step... ain't wine, honey. I'm sorry, like, that ain't wine. It's one That's step like above Mad Dog 2020. Yeah. Uh, twisted the. I think the mean price of the bottles I'm sending ahead are going to be t between fifteen and thirty dollars a bottle. Okay, let me just point out that um, I am not actually a big alcohol drinker, and I only started in 2007. Yeah, it's okay. There's and a bunch of other people at XP wrong. Fest. Yeah, but I'm like fucking 33, dude. Yeah, and there's a bunch of other people in the Mafia. Like, I'm 32 and I rarely drink. <laughs> and if we have like eight people at a table, you know how fast a bottle of wine's gonna go with that? Very yeah. fast. There's also apparently a couple of pubs nearby we could go to. Yeah. This is still just early planning, though. I don't know quite yet what I'm going to do. Shit, dude. I don't even have the money for the fucking uh, airplane ticket yet, so. Yeah. 500 goddamn dollars, dude. Yeah, all my stuff's already covered and paid for, pretty much. Well, except for the hotel room, because that gets charged at the end. Yeah. I need to do my taxes. I, I'm supposed to be, you're supposed to be able to do it for free on the hnrblock.com website. <laughs> no. Bullshit. They charge... They... They will slap on 20 extra bucks, and then they'll charge you for state taxes. I know, because that's what I did this year. Well, I don't have state taxes. Yes. Yeah, Tennessee, yeah, doesn't, doesn't, Tennessee doesn't have an income tax. Hmm. How does it fund itself? Sales tax. That's 10%. Hmm. Yeah, we have, like, the highest fucking sales tax in the surrounding seven states. That explains why. Yep. We I don't know, I guess we're doing pretty good. And I and I and you know what's hilarious? California has a sales tax that's approaching that, and we got state income tax, and we still don't have enough money apparently. Made it for y'all. God damn well, it, San Francisco. I know, man. If the fucking hippies and the and the hipsters and the fucking SJWs weren't just goddamn pissing it all away on stupid bullshit. Well, someone's got. I actually. Well, someone's I actually, got to pay for someone, some of these kids' art degrees. No. Y yes, I know it wasn't going to go through, but I actually signed the petition to get the split California up into six separate states bill. I know it's never going to go through, but I just that slight chance of hope. Question is, well, where would you put? How would you divide, and where would you put the idiots at? <laughs> Um, San Francisco. Yeah, San Francisco and Sacramento will be their own state. They'll be repossessed by China within a few weeks, I'm guessing. No, we kicked San Francisco out of the fucking union. Yeah. Kick it I'm out of the union. Everyone, everyone in, Puerto Rico. in California oh, hates San, San Francisco. Everyone. The only, th the only thing around San Francisco that I'm okay with is Napa Valley, and that's because they produce good wine. Only reason I tolerate Napa Valley. Right. And Sonoma. Move, move the 49ers to another, to another city and there you go. There's no need for San Francisco. They already have. You do realize that it, once San Francisco becomes its own country, they're going to claim Napa Valley for its own. You do know this, right? No, nope. 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 Northern California is going to claim that, mother. Don't yep. fuck with Northern California. Them the rednecks. They played the yep. banjos. Don't fuck with the people with the banjos. You hear banjos, ding, ding, you keep ding, driving. Ding, 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 ding. You hear banjos, you keep driving. 
Mm -hmm. Kind of like what you hear from like um from a uh, game of glaciers which says you want to go that way? No, no, if you want to go there, because you hear the, what you hear the banging doors right away. No. Yeah. Believe it or not, Northern California actually is very conservative, if I remember right. Nice. You mean for rednecks? Yeah, but we got I'm fucking just, rednecks. I'm just saying, um, there's no way in hell they're going to fucking claim uh, uh, Napa Valley, because you know why? The moment they do, Northern California is going to come all like, do you have an army? No. We, we got a bunch a... of gay guys in a per and a float. Do you have a flag? Do you have guns? Our police department have tasers. Do you have a flag? Whoa! You're not gonna fucking last very long, are you? This will be over in an hour. And you know what will be hilarious? Every other wine producing area in Southern California and Central California would go up there and help them. Well. You know how many fucking people are employed in the wine industry? A lot. A fuck ton. I said a lot. And the, these terms are really weird. Oddly enough, it's one of the more incestuous industries, yet it's not negative for it. Because everyone okay. seems to know each other in the wine industry. And that's a good yeah. thing because it increases the quality of the wine. Because everyone's trading tips and secrets and things like that. Be right back. I'm gonna need a wine glass. Okay. I really do hope AAA titles do better this year than they did last year. Because last year's kind of embarrassing. Say again? I kind of hope that, uh, you know, AAA video game titles do better this year than they did last year. Last year was, uh, was kind last of embarrassing. Year, last year was bad, but they get a lot of developers were full of themselves last year, so. Yeah. Hopefully, yeah. Th hopefully this year is the lesson from that. Yeah, same here. Like, right now, the only game I know for a fact is probably going to be guaranteed gold that's coming out this year is the new Metal Gear Solid game. I now have wine. I am happy. Yay, wine. Someone said I'm from a different era and why I asked this question, so maybe you guys can answer it. Why do kids like to hang out on the mall so damn much after hours? No idea. I hang outside the store, I work out with some buddies after hours, but we were just a bunch of night owls. But that's like a grocery store and we just got food and we're just shooting the shit and lost track of time. Yes, yes. I, we're weird. I think uh, it's time I went to the graveyard. Don't do it, Twist. Yes. No, Twisted, don't do it. Yes. They'll make you into one of them. You're oh too my young. god, I have 40,000 gold. What the hell have I been doing for the last half hour? Clicking. Click, 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 click. It's like Minecraft, but even more addictive. Better than Minecraft. It's like if Minecraft. But you can't is... build crazy contraptions like SeaWorld does in his Minecraft. It's I like. I barely even broke ground, Wheel Girl. I'm only talking about theoretical systems and designs in my head. It's... I haven't even tried to implement them yet. It... It's like if Minecraft and Cookie Clicker had a baby. And that baby was conceived in Vegas. Uh, I'll go with New York. Slot machine, Vegas, makes more sense. No! 
maybe he at died. the maybe no, no, at, casino in Japan to explain may, where the pachinko came from. Maybe Atlantic City, but that's sort no, of I a long shot. Button. It has dual citizenship with Japan and Las Vegas. Where was Cookie Clicker, cre Cookie Clicker created? Uh, as far Who as I'm knows? aware, probably Twitter. It's not Twitter. It's Tumblr. Clicker's not Tumblr. It's not? Why are we discussing Cookie Clicker and Tumblr again? Somebody just... I just don't know... I don't know either. Someone You know what? I blame myself. That the the Tumblr part was was my fault. I was I was saying it's like it, boxes is kind of like Minecraft and Cookie Clicker if they had a baby. And it went from there. And okay, that's kind of interesting. And somebody asked where, where Cookie Clicker was made. I, I don't know where Ortiel lives. I just know that, I just know he's got a successful website. He's 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 made, he's made a uh, Cookie Clicker engine to where you can make your own games based around the Cookie Clicker uh, dynamic. And for most of the weekend, I've been punching at a wall. Yes. Okay. I am currently drinking eleven dollar wine that got better day. That's better day two after opening. What the hell, wine? You're screwing oh. with me. I posted in the chat earlier this weekend, and I'll go ahead and put it on the the mumble chat as well. But yeah, that's the that's the wall puncher. It relies on the same uh the same. Dynamics as Cookie Clicker. Only you know now, what? After playing boxes, Cookie Clicker just does not have the same effect. It's the Pachico machine. Yeah. So are artwork. there are there just gonna be a bunch of people just sitting around laptops just playing boxes for some of the uh, XP Fest? No, no, and I'll I'll tell you why. Uh, on Twitter. Also around the same time I discovered the wall punching game, I put out a call for people who want to join me in a gauntlet party. Gauntlet? Okay. Oh, yes. Yeah. Yes, I'm going to be bringing it's... Gauntlet 4 for the Sega Genesis, as well as Midway Arcade Origins for the 360, which has Gauntlet 1 and Gauntlet 2. I've never actually played that, and believe it or not, I've never played a Sega Genesis, or I think that... Oldest console I've ever played was a uh, N sixty four. Oh my god! I scratch that. I think my neighbor had a Sega Genesis, and I played it a few times. Yeah, to, be, to be fair, there was a Gauntlet game on the N sixty four. It was a uh, Gauntlet Legends. I honestly, I never played it, but I hear it was all right. God, I can just imagine looking at myself right now. I'm holding a glass of wine, but I'm also talking about how young I am. What the fuck is going on? Well, to be fair, I'm holding up an, uh, I'm holding up a cup of apple juice and talking about how well. Now I'm talking about how old I'm going to be. <laughs> Shit, turn 36. Is it fucking opposite day? Fuck, yes. I, fuck, I turn 36 next month. I'm. Good God, what have I, I been? I turned 33 last week. What have well, I been doing with my Happy life? belated birthday. Thank you. What have I been doing with my life? Holy shit. I don't know. Uh, using it the way you want to? I don't know anymore. Click, click, click. And you know what? That, that pretty much is it. I spent most of last year doing nothing but clicking. Clickety clack. That reminds me, I need to go look for a resume outline that I can uh, reformat my resume to. 
And then I gotta go get on the big websites and start fucking looking for jobs. Best of luck. Thanks. I got certs, but man, I don't fucking know sometimes. Yeah, uh, what certs do you have right now? Microsoft, uh, it's an MCP for the uh, uh, Windows 7 685, which is basically desktop troubleshooting. Nice. And then I've got Security Plus and I sell. Wait, you have Security Plus? You don't have A Plus or Network Plus with it? No, I don't have Network Plus with it. We, didn't, we weren't required to get Network Plus. Well, what about A Plus? No. Hmm. Although I might get that. I'm probably going to go through the Professor Messer videos. And then, like, go through, like, the ones for Network Plus and maybe maybe even A+. Plus. Yeah, I'm actually working. I actually got from CompTIA their official online uh, essential class for all three of them. So I'm going through that and getting and I'm trying to get all three. Jealous. I, it costs 750 bucks. Yeah! Fucking expensive. Yeah. Too bad you don't have any downloadable material or the fucking books that you could, like, send out my way when you're done. I would if I could. <sighs> hey, if they give me Actually, PDFs, I'll put them in a zip file for you. I think I have a CCNA book, a couple of them. Uh, yeah, I've also got to get my CCNA as well. I'm mean, going to have all four of those, hopefully by the end of the semester, and prospects of having I an AA. I don't an want AA. CCNA. I really don't want CCNA. Uh, it's becoming more and more commonly needed. Networks are yeah. slowly becoming Cisco. Cisco yeah. is they going to be the internet in the next 10 years. Well, this may be true and all, but I really don't want to fucking do network side. I want to do internal help desk. Yeah, I want to go into cybersecurity. So I've got no choice but to be bogged down with networking. I mean, I wouldn't mind doing like a, a level one knock or something if it paid really good. Yeah. I don't want anything under fucking $20, to be honest. Yeah. Yeah, I'm the insane one who's going to be on call 24-7 pretty much. I wouldn't mind that assholes. if they fucking paid me well. Uh, cybersecurity guys, depending on how much experience and what certifications, generally get over six figures a year. I've got five years experience in help and uh, help desk environment, so hopefully that'll fucking help me out. Because when I first started trying to look for a job, I didn't fucking have any experience, so I got turned down left and right, you know. Now or at least really never good. fucking contacted back. What did you finally land? Um, I landed a job at this place called Symphony Services. They laid me off a year later uh, so they could send all their fucking shit to their India office. I dicked around on unemployment trying to find another job. Wound up at Borders, got fired on my birthday, and then I wound up with the job I have here. That ends this next month because we lost the contract. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, it sucks. But hey, you know, at least I'm not getting fired. Well, not fired for performance. I'm just getting laid off because, well, we had too many people making too much money. Yeah, but you guys playing boxes is probably more exciting than what I'm doing in Minecraft. I'm cl I'm making super crops. Well, super crops, you say? Yes. What is a super crop? It is the greatest crop. Using the most advanced forms of genetic engineering via placing sticks on the ground. Oh are... my god. Hey, are you maximizing your space? I've got a fucking plains biome to play with. No, I'm talking about, like, maximizing your crop space. You only need one square of water per four diagonal blocks I'm in modded Minecraft, in and I use above-head sprinklers in a 7x7 seven seven square. Okay, that works awesome. Yeah. No, um, last time I played on the Lorecat server when we still had it, 
I, I, I got pissed off at a lot of people in survival mode making these bullshit fucking farms. But it's for aesthetics. Like, dude, you're in survival mode. Fucking make it goddamn efficient. Okay, so far I've got super cotton and super wheat. Would you say that your farm is miraculously efficient or just remarkably efficient? Above averagely efficient. It farms itself pretty much. Neat. I did not have any mechanisms for actually uh, harvesting my own crops. I just did it by hand. Yeah, I, I'm using modern Minecraft, so I've got a machine that does all the work for me. Okay. Feed the beast. Uh, actually, it's Resident Rise off of At Launcher with a few mods added. Gosh, it must have been a long time since I've last played Minecraft. Yeah, I don't play anymore either. Yeah, and this is only partially survival. I'm kind of using creative mode to create these things. Peter. Do I look like I give a fuck? I have no. wine. I have no fucks to give. Uh, uh, I was yeah. playing Minecraft uh, during the weekend. But mostly it was with it, it was on the, the it was on Darish's server. I want I want fucking uh, moonshine, like authentic moonshine, not the shit that you get the fucking lo uh, liquor store. That reminds real me. hillbillies. Fuck yeah, real back with goddamn moonshine. Hell yeah, the best, moonshine the, the closest, in Maybach Woods. The closest we got in our area is we got the stuff called Silver Lightning that's done in a distillery. I think it's Lame. fifty-five proof. In a distillery, Sorry, like fifty-five percent. My bad. Wait, Lame. it's done in a distillery, like every other alcohol. Yeah. So basically, okay. it's a liquor store moonshine. It's not real moonshine. It's artisan. Shh. Doesn't count. They also do bourbon. Doesn't count unless it's made in the backwoods by some fucking hillbilly trying not to get caught by the cops. And he's got to have at least thirteen toes. Well, no, 13 toes is not required. He can have the normal amount, or even less than the normal amount. Might be missing a couple fingers, too. Definitely missing teeth. Most likely. Most certainly. Actually, no, some of them make enough money to have a good dental plan. Or they have a TV show. Yes. Where are you hiding screenshots? I can never fucking find you. Uh, it's usually under user and roaming. User roaming. No, no, no. I, I'm modern oh. Minecraft. Oh. Little different. Teeny tiny little bit. Oh, different. that's Feed the Beast Infinity. No freaking wonder. Well. I'm a derp. Go ahead and laugh at me. Ha 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 ha. Stop being so mean, you're hurting my feelings. Get over it. Here they are. Here it is. Hold on, let me get the imager. Yeah, that's what. That's essentially my current area. It's above ground, just kind of working on it. But uh, yeah, that's basically what my farm's gonna look like in the future. Though it will have a greenhouse around it. Oh God, I have two hundred and fifty fucking fire crystals. That's a lot of fire crystals. So is it actually possible to craft anything yet? Yeah. Okay, so all of these ingredients actually are in the game. Yeah, most of them. Hmm, guess I just need to keep looking. 
Damn it, the wooden water tank the still, is still is glitched. Oh, there is a crafting section in the shop. Yep. How about that? Okay, any other seeds you think I should make into super crops? Right now? Uh, super watermelons. I can do yes. super watermelons. Do it. Super potato! I can do potatoes too. I love making a fish. God damn it, no problem with that. I, I love fucking making efficient watermelon farms. You double row that shit and you put the water on the outside. Awesome. Yeah, that reminds yep. me in a short while I'm I'll go ahead and switch over to to, to the, the server and uh, show everybody what I've been making. Yeah. But yeah, uh, those little wooden things you see in there, those things are called crops, and they make everything so much more efficient. Don't have to replant. Ever. Oh, do those actually work now? Uh, crops? Um, it's in modern Minecraft, but yeah. They're the well, they agricraft them, ones. Uh, they had them in See the Beast one too, but they made a they made just like beans or something. Yeah, IC2 had it. It didn't. It worked, but it was a little finicky, if I remember right. Um, and it was a little random with the mutations, where Agricraft took those concepts and kind of perfected them. But yeah, if you see all the cross beams on there, that means it's a cross crop crop thingy. Um, all it does is it means it allows crops to spread. It's how I can essentially, with one seed, plant an entire field. It just takes time okay. for it to grow and spread, and it just costs sticks. So. That's a nice farm. Yes. You're jealous over the automated watering system, aren't you? Just a little bit. Yeah. But that's okay. I, I, I can make it the way I like it, and it's fine. Yep. But yeah, I'm going to have, what is it, super, uh, I've got super cotton, super wheat, and I'm going to have super melons. Okay. Yeah, I'm making these super crops for one very important reason. The uh, main power source of my facility is going to be something called ethane, and it eats a fuck ton of biofuel to make. And I can only get essentially two bio, uh, sorry, four biofuel per wheat, and I eat a lot of it. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I need to upload something else that's in my area. You're really going to be jealous over this. That's what my front door will open up to. Yikes. Yep, Meteor Cove. Okay, okay.
Okay, good. There is some oak in my area. 